What's going on, guys? It's Steve. I don't know how it can get any worse for Carmelo Anthony, whether it's the Knicks blaming him for stuff that's not his fault. Now there are reports that Lala and Melo are separating after seven years of being married. That It's just like everything is falling apart for Melo. I'm not going to make any assumptions on what's going on. That That's not my place. I'm just here to report the news. Uh, Melo and Lala are splitting. Um, some people are saying they're splitting because he's not as big of a star player as he used to be and you know she doesn't want to be with someone like that anymore it's not good for her brand i don't know i don't believe in any of that crap whatever it is it's between them two it's not for the public to know i'm just here to report it but i, I mean it's just like if it's not one thing it's the next with mellow and I, I just feel so bad for him you know th this is probably the worst year he's had in a long long time with, with the knicks blaming him for stuff that's not his fault with phil jackson trying to kick him off the team you know what carmelo anthony needs a very very long vacation with his son um you know just father and son and it sucks to have another fit another young boy Growing up in a divided household, I grew up like that. It's fucking so shitty. Hopefully, though, everything starts to turn around for Melo. He's definitely getting traded this season. Well, this off season, hopefully, he goes to Cleveland or the Los Angeles Clippers, and he can finally win himself a championship. Uh, but all, the only thing that matters to me in this situation between Lala and Melo is that Melo gets to stay in his son's life because. Every young child needs a father growing up. And this is more of a confirmation that Melo's leaving New York. I mean, we already pretty much knew it. But because, you know, like him saying, oh, you know, New York's where my family is. It's where Lala, you know, has a lot of successful things here. I have a lot of successful things here. We built our brand here. My son goes to school here. So it's just more confirmation that he's leaving to either the Clippers or the Cleveland Cavaliers. Um, you know, I, I don't know, man. It's just so freaking downhill. It's crazy how fast things can change for someone. Like literally, uh, a few years ago, everyone was riding Melo. Oh my goodness, he's the third best player in the world. And now all of a sudden, it's just like, you know, everyone just doesn't want to be a part of him. It's 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 messed up. Man. Thankfully, though, we have, you know, the NBA surrounding him and, you know, defending him against Phil Jackson. The NBPA came out and defended him and complained to the commissioner about what Phil Jackson has done to him and things like that. It's crazy, though, man. Like. It just this came out of nowhere, you know, and I, I I can't imagine what he's going through right now with you know the frustration of again not making the playoffs and then getting blamed for everything and then the trade rumors and then now the divorce with him and his wife. It's not a divorce, but it's it's a split. Um, well, actually, I think she actually did file a divorce, but either way, man, it's, it's I feel bad for him. Anyway, guys, short little video. I'm out. Peace.